Today's adventure begins by looking at the Mickey Power Pole, I-4 westbound, as a recording of this Saturday, March 5th. 2022 and I am heading to Hollywood Studios for my second Disney theme park visit of the year. There's a few things happening in Batu East, Galaxy's Edge, that I want to attend. I just feel like embracing a little Star Wars today, so I'm going to. And looking at the skies, looks going to be a pretty beautiful day today. There's some crows right there on the top of this van. Hello, crows. I brought my droid with me today, too. There's a droid meetup happening in Batu East. Another reason I'm here. Wearing an appropriate t-shirt. Welcome, everyone. Adam the Woo here. R2T Woo. My R2 unit droid that I built about a year ago is in this little backpack. I also just finished up Book of Boba Fett. I like The Mandalorian, and of course I like the original trilogy, and you know, some of the Disney movies as well, as far as the franchise goes. But I really enjoyed Book of Boba Fett and Mandalorian. So I'm kind of in the mood now, now that I just finished that. I'm popping in. I got my Bounty Hunter shirt on, and R2T Woo strapped on my back. I'm inviting you to join me. Shall you? And there's a nice little breeze walking down what usually is the tram path. Trams have popped back into some of the other parks, like Magic Kingdom, but not here at Studios yet. I'll probably bump into a few friends in there too. They're also going to be kind of milling around. See how the day goes. No real game plan. Except bringing the droid and might even buy an accessory. The droid depot. Just playing it by ear. Just having a good day. Enjoying this Saturday as a recording of this. I went ahead and loosened the straps a little bit. It was a little too tight along my shoulders, but this flap kind of folds down and you can see R2T Woo. Clever name. You know, not R2D2, but R2T W O O. And I put some fresh batteries in the remote and in the droid itself. So he's also ready for an exciting day. And they are still doing park reservations, which I have. Procured. Walking in directly down Hollywood Boulevard, noticing it is incredibly busy. A lot, well, not incredibly busy, but a lot busier than I've seen it before. But it is a weekend, so it kind of makes sense. Trying to find coffee, but Starbucks was lengthy line, as was Joffrey's. To be honest with you, I don't even know if they have coffee back in Batu East. I gotta be, I'm gonna, I'm gonna look out for some coffee. Okay, I just inquired. And Ronto Roasters has coffee until 11 a.m., so I am in luck. They're brewing it right now underneath this pod racer engine. Good thing that I asked, because I didn't see it on the signage, but until 11 a.m. Thank you, droid. I needed this. I needed a little pick-me-up before my Batu East day. I'm going to put a little bit of cream and sugar in this too. I think that's around the side. Ah yes, this is always a beautiful sight. The fastest hunk of junk in a theme park. Millennium Falcon. Ah yes, the marketplace. Theming on point. Let's see if there's any new merchandise that I have. I haven't really perused through here in a while. Let's see if there's any new merchandise. Do a little window shopping. And speaking of Book of Boba, some merchandise down here. Boba Fett's gauntlets right over there. I think that might be new. Of course, the jet pack they had a while back. I never purchased that. And then the mug here. You could even get a helmet if you so choose the, the mask up top there. I normally don't carry a backpack around with me, but because I brought R2T Woo with me, I could buy a little plush to go in. Possibly the Judas Iscariot of the franchise. Nah, I pass. Pass on that one. Or maybe a Stormtrooper. You have regular Chewy, but then you also have leftover from Life Day Chewy. Would be kind of humorous to, to walk around with a Jar Jar in tow. And Bricky has arrived. I'm going to give you my camera because I want to introduce you to another friend. Oh, yeah? That is now tagging along. Oh, more, more guest stars? All right, look at this. Look at this, Bricky. Notice he's on my backpack? Oh, yeah. See him? See him. Do you see him? Yeah, I see two of them. Who are you looking at? Is that? 
Me so happy to see Jar Jar? Say his name. <laughs> Say his name. <laughs> How many people you think are walking around with a Jar Jar? You, my friend. You. That shows your hardcore. Shows your hardcore. And Leia's indoor outfit. I think that's new as well. I say indoor, but technically it's outdoors because all this, that little gift shop area, a little vestibule is outdoors. It's a, it's a bad joke, I know. It's come a long way since those Streets of America days. Streets of America used to run right through basically where I'm standing at the moment. Ah, back in the MGM studio days. I just realized I need to go say hi to the Coca-Cola droids. It's been a while. Up, oh, hello there, Sandy. Over by Rise of the Resistance, this is Sandy. Just, just said hello, nodded, up. Oh, good to see you. There's a number of these Coca-Cola droids. Always good to see you, Sandy. It's been a while. Oh, look over here. Appears to be a few troopers are out over by Kylo's ship. It's hard, it's hard to read emotions from, from troopers. It's very hard to read emotions. Try not to make eye contact. Trying not to make eye contact. Uh, okay, sorry. Sorry about that. All right, I will. Now this is kind of interesting. The little open walkway that they have specifically for the Star Cruiser is open to anyone that could just walk back in here. The hedges have been removed. So I'm gonna walk back in here. Evidently, this must be just like a little shaded area. I wonder if a Rancor will ever pop out of here. I can just totally picture a Rancor. Wow, this is cool. This is where you, I haven't done the Star Cruiser yet. No plans on doing that for quite a while. But this is where you enter in from the Star Cruiser. Evidently, because no one is entering in at this time frame from the Star Wars Hotel, they're allowing guests to get out of the elements and into, into the shaded area. That's pretty neat. I kind of do miss the troopers and Kylo and the other characters just wandering around, however. I kind of miss them being on ground level. I don't think I've ever seen this before. A fairy droid accessory kit. That's pretty interesting. And there's also this serving tray kit right down here. Almost like on Jabba's barge, Jabba's palace in Return of the Jedi. You can have one of these on your R2 unit. This is neat, a blaster, a a blaster attachment. Yeah, that might be kind of cool. Connects to the R-Series legs. So that would work. I have an R-Series. Just like this one right here. Mine looks a little bit different, but that is a R-Series, you know, R2 T-Woo. There's also jet attachments right here. Ooh, I wonder what this goes on to the... This has lights and sound effects. Connects to the legs as well. Oh, goodness. This is what that looks like out of the box with the extended legs over there. Oh, there's a BB unit and an R2 unit down in there. Oh, hello BB. How's it going? Good to see you. I'm going to go to the droid meetup. I am. Oh, this is what it looks, what the, that's what the blasters look like. All right, let me introduce you to Dano from the Dano channel. Yeah. <laughs> and you are the organizer of today's droid meetup. Yeah, Mubo's Droid Builders Club. What is it so, called? Mubo's Droid Builder Club. So Mubo is the alien that runs the droid depot. Okay. So we named our club after him, but we'll uh, get the droid depot droids. Take them home and custom paint them, add some rust, add special colors, whatever. So you go you go a little deeper than I do. I just have pretty much the most basic R2 unit. Now, I remember you did one of these in Anaheim a couple years ago and you had a Tiki Droid. Tiki Droid, yeah, Rongo, R0, NG0. Did yeah, you bring, you didn't bring Tiki no, Droid out to Florida? Too much to bring across the country. Gotcha. So, so you got both, you got the best of both worlds. You got yeah. the, the BB the unit BB and the R unit. R unit. It's just called an R unit, not an R2 unit, right? It's an R unit, yeah. Oh, Kylo has arrived here. Look, I knew Kylo was gonna show up. Yeah, the song. Kind of wandering around for the next few minutes until everyone kind of accumulates with their droids over next to the depot. Still got a couple minutes before it officially begins. Oh, I gotta wonder if these troopers are gonna break up the, the meetup that is happening. The droid meetup is happening right over here next to the depot. So I just gotta wonder. What? I don't think he's talking. I don't think he's talking to me. He's not talking to me. He's telling me to carry on. They all just keep telling me to carry on. Maybe Jar Jar. Maybe he'll see Jar Jar. Right here. Right here. Right there. Wave Jar Jar. Wave at the trooper. Get his attention. 
Oh, that he doesn't like Jar Jar either. That trooper doesn't like Jar Jar. Let's try it again. We got Jar Jar here. Got to try the power of Jar Jar. Uh, no, he doesn't like Jar Jar. All right, he's on the move now. He's on the move. I'm trying to operate this at the same time. Now they obviously make it very difficult for it to kind of move around because there's like footprints in the concrete there. But I could spin, spin the head around as well. I'm trying to do this with one hand with this as I'm like the same. He's stuck. He's stuck now. Go, go, go. <laughs> I'm getting pretty good at this one hand and riding on the hard concrete. The droid, the droid is in the middle of the droid meetup. Danny702, have you ever met my droid? No, he's not name. Wait, his head's not turning around. There it goes. Oh, how cool is that? You were going to bring your droid. What it happened? Was. It's humongous. You brought, <laughs> you had, you know what, you, your droid is not from Galaxy's Edge. No, I bought it like 12 years ago. It's like a full, full size R2 it's unit, like, right? I mean, not full size. Maybe like, down to there, yeah, like knee high. Two feet. Have you ever driven one of these before? No. Got it. Need a little help. Oh, there, oh. <laughs> I'm gonna kind of meander around and look at some of the other ones. It's a pretty neat little little backpack there. That unit. That's pretty cool. The designs on that one. But the look at this one, very futuristic looking. There's another R unit there. Now Ricky just asked me something that I didn't know the answer to. Did I make my droid in Batu East or West? I had to think about that for a yeah, minute. Yeah, you were stuck. And after a little contemplating, I made him here in Batu East, not in California. I, I think I remember watching that. Yeah. Ten months ago, give yeah. or take. Yeah. I just needed to know the citizenship. Have, are you? Have you ever built a droid? I have, and I gave it away to a random kid in the park. And now I want it back. So if you see the kid I gave the droid to, there's a bounty on his head. I'm not going to give you this, but I want you to. to Drive him around. Oh, I would love to. I'm gonna give you the. I'm gonna give you the remote. Free range. Go for it. Go, go. Watch out for the toes. You got it. You got it. You got this, Ricky. Little push. Give him a little push. Just needs a little wind. <laughs> you having fun? Bring it back memories? It's so much fun. <laughs> it's the little things in life. Out of the way. Take it over. Have him go meet some friends. Have him go meet some friends. Have him go meet some friends over there. <laughs> you can turn his head too. So you have also brought a droid. G A T R. G A T R. G A T R. G A T R. Great Gator. Gator from Florida. Okay. Oh, because it's the Florida Gator colors. There you go. I like that. Gator. I like that. That's cool. What's your name? Troy. Troy. Good to meet you, Troy. I like it. Pretty good turnout. Oh, Grogu has arrived here. And you got the Darksaber as well. And you got a BB unit. <laughs> and the Mandalorian has also arrived. Nice. And I've also got an R2 unit. You got an R2 unit back here too. Yeah, does your R2 unit have a name? The R2 is R3AHT. R3AHT. Yeah. What about the BB unit? This is LD42. LD42. Yep. Good to see you, Mando. Keep up the good work. All right, Mando. One day I'm gonna buy a lot. I'm gonna buy a dark saber. I'm gonna have one. Man. I know you didn't purchase yours. You got that the correct way, right? Oh, I think of my droid. Thanks, buddy. All right, you rarely see Mando without his 
helmet on. You were going to film for your YouTube channel, but you decided just to dress yeah. up instead. Give a, sh give a shout out to your YouTube channel. So my YouTube channel is General Kenobi's Campaign, but soon it's going to be renamed to The Batu Brothers. The Batu Brothers, but for now, General Kenobi's yep. Campaign. It should be renamed in the next few days. All right. Ben and I are doing a collab, me and him together, at The Batu Brothers. The Batu, I love it. Thanks, man. Oh, there you go, Grogu. Use the force, Grogu. Use the force. Oh, oh, where are you going, Grogu? <laughs> there it is! Yeah! <laughs> Definitely a good turnout. I thought maybe there'd be a handful of people, but there's like a good 20, 30 people that are kind of perusing around. Oh, look at this one. White in assortment. Okay, we're now noticing over near these other two Coca Cola droids, the area over here is now empty. So the whole droid meetup is now going to move over here and be able to move around this little area a little bit better, which is going to be pretty awesome. Oh, yeah. There we go. The floodgates have been opened. <laughs> a lot easier to move around on this. to go with one hand but it's a lot easier on this than it is that concrete area Whoop, mine's getting dizzy mine's getting dizzy in the corner. My droid is saying hello. Twisting twisting its head around saying hi. Over there. Nice to meet you. New arrival. Alright, everyone's everyone's getting dizzy. They're all spinning. They're all spinning. <laughs> it's a spin fast. <laughs> I'm getting dizzy just watching these. Oh, there goes a BB unit. This one's really customized. Looks, looks really awesome. There's some really good ones out here. Really good ones. What did you think of the retractable fan when you saw that? It was cool. It was really cool looking. Yeah. Uh, they found out. They found out what was going on. They ran a line. Like they, they don't like what's going on down here. Oh goodness. Now the all the troops are coming over there. Definitely 
Dano, Dano, they're on to you. Yep. They're on to you, Dano. Oh, no. no. Get out of here. Now what? These are not the droids you're looking for. <laughs> That's how you handle them, Dana. Yeah. Oh, I'm noticing another Grogu there. That's a pretty, pretty neat looking backpack there, the jetpack as well. That's cool. Nothing to see here, troopers. All right, your porgs have names? Oh my God, it was Porg, Porg Soka. Uh, well, this is Porgkins, of course. Porgkins. Okay, yeah, yeah, true, Porgkins. true. R2 Porg2. R2 Porg2. C3P Org. C3P Org's taking a nap down here. Yes, he is. Yeah, I like that. Anyway, very cool. And then I have uh, I got a bunch of them. Chewbacca with a little Porg. And then back here, you got a couple back here. Han Solo and uh, Ray back there. Han Solo Porg and Ray Porg. I love it. We have Porg names for all of them, but I. Yeah, there's a lot, it's a lot to keep up with. <laughs> Saying move along. We're not moving along. We're gonna stay right here. Nope, we're not moving along. Okay, wait a second. It looks like everyone is moving along. They're obeying nicely. I guess that's it. I guess, I guess the trooper has spoken. Oh, no, no, it's a group photo. I was saying, gosh, we're very obedient. <laughs> What's this droid's name? That is Gus. He's got a bit of an attitude. This is Gus and he has a little bit of an attitude. Actually a lot of an attitude. A lot of an attitude. He doesn't like it when I say this. But... Alright Gus, I'm gonna get I'm gonna get my, my thermal detonator Coca-Cola here, purchase it from, from Gus. He's got a little bit of an attitude though. Oh yes. Tasty. I'm drinking thermal. Ah. Oh, that's good. Ooh. That's real good. Not when in Rome. You gotta have one of these when in Batu. East. Ah. Wow. Recognize probe droid. I always felt bad for this one here. I always felt bad for this one that's upside down, getting almost like the, the hot branding there on the bottom. Back over here in the resistance area, kind of look at some of the Black Spire stuff. And I kind of like this. I think at some point, maybe when I get down to the weight I want to be at, I think this would, I think this would kind of look good on me this style of long sleeve. Right now it's starting to get, get warm again, so I don't know if that'll be anytime soon. But. One thing I've never noticed is this green blotch on the petrified tree over here near the area where they hide the rancor. See over there, she's protecting the door from the rancor that could escape. You hear Chewie off in the distance. She's got her lightsaber. Is this where the rancor hides? No rancor? No. A lot of banthas? But no rancors, right? That's good. I don't want. There's a head of a rancor? Here's the rancor, right here. There's the rancor head. Right there. That's the rancor. What is that thing? What is that? It's our raptor. Gotcha. 
I like your port. Oh, thank you. Does he have a name? Yeah, Sir Lawrenson. Say it again. Sir Lawrenson. Sir Lawrenson? Yeah, I like new, unique names. <laughs> okay, nice. Yeah. Thank you. You're welcome. Enjoy your day. Watch out for the rancor. Oh, that one. Truthfully, though, this is kind of kind of cool. You know what this reminds me of? The movie Alien, when the chest burster pops up. Pops up. I never realized the rancor's head is very similar to the chest burster from Alien. Hello, Pork. Oh, hi. <laughs> nice to see you, Pork. Have a good day. You know, one of these days, I think I am going to purchase the DJ Rex droid down here. One of these days. It's not a, it's not a build your own droid. The DJ Rex, he used to pilot, pilot Star Tours. Now he's a DJ in Oga's Cantina. I see we're not the only ones out exploring today. Hello. Enjoy. Hold on. I'm sure that will make a lovely pet. Good luck. Good luck. You're leaving with Eric and Dave. Bye, Mia. All in. Are you leaving? Oh, wait. Wait, he's leaving. May the... This menace has been contained. May the force be with you. Always. We know. Thanks for the tip, Jedi. That's going to do it for today. See you in the next video. <laughs> Vlog. It's over. As I'm walking back to my car in the parking lot, look over here. Okay, see you later, Turkey.